I want you to find a set of bunker gear that you want to put on. Shawnee Mission's new signature program, Project Blue Eagle, is soaring. In its first semester, more than 650 students enrolled in this program that prepares students for public safety careers. It's a, it's a pathway for students interested in public service, so police, firefighter, EMT, and a legal career. So this is year one, and after this year, uh, we'll offer all three of those pathways for students that want to pursue it further. What's the target for the fire scene? Uh, five. five minutes or less, eight percent of our calls. Go! <laughs> After students have their bunker gear in hand, it's a race to see who can suit up first. This first-hand experience is key to Project Blue Eagle. I think the, the opportunity to get hands-on experience um, doing those skills and those things that police officers and firefighters do and I, probably just the practical nature of the courses. Unlike some of the, more, the other core classes, they're much more career focused. Um, I've enjoyed um, learning about the history of it and like the equipment. It's a great opportunity for high schoolers to learn about um, the bumper gear and all that stuff and you get to learn from like um, a firefighter's point of view. My class is pretty fun. The teachers are amazing. They've been working with us hands-on most of the time because this is a hands-on experience. In this exercise, students put their skills to the test in a simulated mass casualty event. They sorted out the patients according to their needs and then they attended to those needs with the first aid skills that they've been taught. I know Overland Park will need great police officers and firefighters and paramedics in the future. Uh, why not get them from growing right in our backyard, serving the mission of their community, living in their community. That is a great, safe way to uh, identify if that's something you want to do to uh, you know, commit your life to. I think it's awesome. I didn't even know they had it until like, I joined the class. I'm a really want to be a firefighter when I grow up, so I thought this would be a good first step to get more knowledge about being a firefighter. I'm looking forward to hopefully getting to be able to like ride on a fire truck, learn about the tools on a fire truck, and like all the bunker gear and all the cool stuff that we get to do. Through Project Blue Eagle, students can move ahead more quickly in the path to a public service career. Wonderful head start in those careers. As I talked to um, Chief Douglas, he explained to us how much of a head start our kids will have in regard to fire science and going to the police academy and also in legal studies. So some of them will be ready to go as close as two years ahead of the competition, if you will. When we build a fire station, we sometimes will hire 12, 15 people at a time. And that means 12 or 15 people typically come up for retirement at a time. So when folks are walking out the door with 30, 35 years of experience, we need to fill someone with, with zero years of experience to try to fill that gap. More hands-on training for Project Blue Eagle students. Here they learn different methods to remove a ring that's stuck on a patient's finger. Today I was invited to come down and be a, a guinea pig, if you will, for how to remove a ring um, that is stuck on a person's finger. So I got to be the one where they actually cut it off with the Dremel machine. But little did they know just how quickly they'd have to put this training into practice when Principal Lowe moved his ring to a different finger. And when I put it on my other hand, it got stuck. So then they had to use a different method to get that off. So it was real world application. After completing this project, our view on crime is slightly different. In Introduction to Public Service, Project Blue Eagle students study crime statistics and learn how the information can be used by law enforcement. Lucas Hagen says he's here to learn more about police work. I'm, I'm interested in becoming a police officer, so I figured it would help me get some knowledge on, like, say, like what a police officer does. I'm really excited about learning, like, that, that what they do, you know, because it's all glorified on TV and movies, but in real life, you know, it's it's much different. It, it's a difficult job. I'm not going to lie to you, but it's it's great pride in knowing that you're helping the community and you're helping others out every day. There are people interested in this. They just need that education. And to give them quality instruction is very positive, just not for them, but also for the community. 